And with COVID measures easing all around the world, more Canadians are flying again. But that's leading to tensions and frustrations at airports right across the country, especially at Canada's largest airport, Pearson International. Hillary Johnstone is with us out of Ottawa this morning. Hillary, we are seeing these striking images, long lines of passengers, long delays. What's causing this and what are we hearing in more detail? Good morning, Heather. Well, according to the Canadian Airports Council, what's causing all of that uh, are long lines at customs as people are screened for COVID-19. So in some cases, this is due to COVID testing. In other cases, it's due to health questions that uh, officials are asking international travelers when they arrive at Pearson Airport, Canada's largest airport. In some cases, passengers are being asked to wait on the airplanes because these airports are simply not designed to have long customs processes where you would have very long lines of people in the hallways waiting to be screened because what we're hearing from the Canadian Airports Council is that due to all those COVID-19 procedures it's taking four times longer than it did before the pandemic to get through customs so in some cases passengers are waiting on airplanes for about 20 minutes after their flight lands in other cases they're waiting for more than an hour so you can just imagine the frustration uh, that that is causing travelers uh, as travel ramps back up again as people are getting ready uh, to head out for the summer because what we're hearing from uh, officials of the Canadian Airports Council is that yes these protocols have been in place for two years now wasn't a big of a problem when people weren't traveling as much but now they are that's what's causing uh, all of these long lines in particular Heather at Pearson so